Yeah, it's really cool to see students doing all these fun things. All right, here's a quick look outside. This is for areas like downtown LA, and I will give Arcadia's um, high temperature a quick shout out in a bit too as well. But we're definitely looking at the clouds this morning. So we're looking at low clouds and fog, uh, waking up to gray skies again, and then it's going to take some time for a lot of the clouds to clear. So once we head into the afternoon, we're going to look at some sun and clouds. That marine layer is about 1,500 feet in thickness, so it's going to be a slow burn off for the morning. But then once we head to the second half of the day, we will see much more sunshine. But we're gearing up for even cooler weather. So today we're looking at temperatures sticking to below average again, but it's going to cool even more as we head into tomorrow. And we're looking at that chance of patchy drizzle Wednesday morning, maybe even Thursday morning. And then we have a cutoff low pressure system that slides just to the east of us, what we call an inside slider that could bring us a chance of light rain Thursday night into Friday. So that's something that we're watching. Things are changing up here in Southern California. Our temperatures right now, this is the reason why you should probably grab a sweatshirt or maybe a light jacket because we're looking at mid to upper 50s inland. So 52 for Claremont, 53 for Simi Valley. We have 64 for LAX. And then here's a look at a high resolution future cap. So again, the clouds are going to stick around later this morning. And then just before the lunch hour, a lot of our inland communities, we start to see clouds kind of fade away. But by 1 p.m., we're still dealing with a little bit more of the clouds near the coast and then for areas like the South Bay and then also near the Long Beach area. And then by the time we head into the latter part of the afternoon, things start to clear. And then by the evening, you can see we start to see much more of that marine influence surging as we wait for that system to the north of us to push in a lot more of the cooler air and more of the clouds. So downtown LA, you're actually going to start to see that break in sunshine later on, probably about 11 a.m. And then we start to see much more of the sun and clouds mixture as we head into the afternoon. So Inland Empire, low 80s through tomorrow, and then that chance of showers from that inside slider starts to pick up Thursday for you, Thursday night into Friday morning. And then by the time we head into the weekend, we're slowly warming up. All right, back to you guys. All right, Amber, thank